Hey, how's it going guys? Dark Eye TCG here, and today I have a Japanese Pokemon Sun and Moon 3. Did you see the Fighting Rainbow booster box? Or have you heard of the Fighting Rainbow? I've seen like three different translations for this set, and like one or two for the other one, so... I'm just gonna call it, have you seen the Fighting Rainbow? So I've got Ho-Ho and Charizard on the front cover. Really cool, um text right there for the set. Got the same colors as the ho-ho, the rainbow uh, feathers. Alright, so let's see what get tools I can get. So I kind of opened it already so it doesn't take too long to open. Take off the plastic. Alright, hopefully I can, I don't think I will, but under 15 minutes, probably a little bit uh, over 15, like 17 minutes or something. But yeah, Sun and Moon 3, you've seen the Battle Rainbow. So I'm gonna start off on the left side this time. I really like the green, it looks nice. Alright, first pack. I've got a Charmeleon, this bird thing, bug, rolls, and um, I'll come back to it for that one. Uh, what was that one called? Horsey, the fire monkey, who hoot. All right, we start off with a Lolan uh, Muck GX. Got a trainer card. Looks pretty nice. Put down all those. Oh, never mind. Never mind. That's the first hollow I got. So if I can get like a Charizard. Uh, full art. Or the hello in the uh, grammar. Fire monkey, some bug. The evolution. I forgot what this one's called. Really good Pokemon though from fifth generation. Noctowl. Crab with the uh, funny hair, Cedra, Lucario, nice. Uh, trainer. The grass monkey, um, Noiburn's Revolution. I would like to get Noivern too, with the full art or something. To some, uh, another crab looking Pokemon. Uh, Riolu, running on the beach. We've got a Yarn Marrow. Looks really nice. We've got the Evolution of the Grass Monkey. We've got Heracross. Really nice artwork as well. Got this uh, trainer's card. I guess it has something to do with fire types. I suppose. Charmander. Really sad looking in the rain. I really do like that Charmander though. Got that sandcastle Pokemon on me up walking down the stairs. Uh, Viable. And I got Persian. Gloom. I got that uh, fighting monkey Pokemon going against Lucario. Got some uh, some 
dumbbells, trainer. Oh, nice. Dark cry. Awesome. Um, a zoom rail. Really nice artwork as well, just like the narrow. Oddish. Oh, nice. We got a trainer um, for the full art. I've actually never pulled a, a trainer for a full art. Whenever I get a full art, it's always a, a Pokemon, so that's nice. Something new. Not really sure who this is. Um, again, because I didn't play the seventh generation games, but look at that hollow. Very rainbow effect. Very nice. I'm glad I pulled something different. And we got the Rolts, or not Rolts, um, a Rotom. Man, that took a while to finally pull a trainer full art. Very cool. Uh, OOGX right behind it. Very nice looking card. Awesome. These are really kind of dusty. I don't know how. They were in a little plastic sleeve. Very nice. Really glad they did this for the Cinnamon 3 where you're guaranteed a secret rare better. Gives you a slightly better chance of collecting the set. Higher chance of getting the cards you want. Oh, so the hollow is in the front. Or, no, it's not. It's the third card. Uh, the grass one. Noiburn's Revolution, uh, Diancy. Looks really nice. The background's good. Cool. I actually really like that card. Charmeleon. Is the Sandcastle Evolution? Alright, last pack on the left side. They already got three um, hollows on the left side, so maybe two more from the right. I don't think I'm just gonna get one more, but we'll see. I have a feeling I'm gonna get an Ultra as well. I don't know, just for some reason, calling it right now, I'm going to get an Ultra Rare and a GX. One more GX. Hoot hoot. This Pokemon looks really cool, but don't know the name. Got a Yarn Meryl. So I know like the English versions of these, you get way more of those than the Japanese ones. Uh, Maya Bloom. How about that? Oh, this one's um, an Alamar. There you go. 
at least I think that this is Malamar. Malamar might be the Bray Evolution. Another Lucario. Here's that trainer girl I got on the floor. I assume she might be a this trainer you run into in the game or gym leader. Are those even gym leaders in Generation 7? Was there? Maybe a team uh, skull member? Heracross? Oddish, Alolan Grammar, Elf, nice, Charizard GX. It's always nice pulling the Charizard. It's nice, very nice. Got the Roto Trainer card. So there's one GX right there. And then an Ultra Rare. I'm still calling it. Going to get an Ultra Rare. So I feel like four. Um, like double rares or higher just isn't enough. You should at least get five to six hollows, and then the rest should be regular, regular rare hollows. Meryl, Riolu. Another dark guy. Cool. Let's see another hollow, I think. Never mind. Sandcastle dude, fire guy, Seija, Horsey, Persian. So I have three more packs left. Let's see if I am right. I can get an ultra. Gloom, Meow, Another Dancing, Zumro, Meryl. Alright, final pack. Let's see if I can get more than four hollows. But I got a Kindra. That's the first one. Got the Kindra, and it's kind of hard to see, but there's a Azumarill right there. So that's nice. Alrighty then. Not bad. At least it was a different hollow I didn't pull yet. So, got a Charizard GX, Ho Ho GX, Full Art Trainer, which is nice because I've never pulled a Full Art Trainer before. And on a low and a muck. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Be sure to check out my channel for more Pokemon TCG openings. I still have one more box of each one. Uh, leave a comment down below what you thought of the set. Your favorite pools. Uh, what cards did you get if you managed to um, pick up a box yourself. And yeah. Thank you so much for watching again. And I'll catch you guys later in the next opening.